good Friday night to you sports fans. You've come to the right place. It's the NBA on 2K Sports. Moments away, it'll be the Phoenix Suns going up against the Los Angeles Lakers. Kevin Harlan here, and I'm joined by Greg Anthony, Clark Kellogg, and David Aldridge, who's reporting from the sidelines. is a special regular season game, Clark. Bitter rivals going at it. And you know, in these types of contests, Kevin, we've seen it. You've got to play with emotion, but not become emotional. Keep your cool. We probably will see a few scuffles in this one because of the competitive nature of these teams. But controlling your emotions will be paramount. The shot's good for Nash. And the quickness of Nash's game just Taking a shot there before the defense has a chance to react. Right wing. Corner shot. And that one's good by G. He's just such a well-rounded offensive player. He's got a little bit of everything. And here's Nash. Outside Hill. Nash outside. Six on the shot clock. Here's the screen. Rebounded by the Lakers. It's Kobe Bryant on the way. Plays it up and thanks it in. Now that's too easy for Kobe. The closer he gets, the more dangerous he becomes. Nash with it. Nash to Fry. Back to Nash. Pass to Douglas. Some nice ball movement here by the Suns. Nash the pass to Douglas. For three. Hill. That one doesn't go. Ryan against Richardson. Kobe misses. Very dangerous to leave a guy like that open. Lucky break there for the D. Richardson outside. Nash with the screen on Bryant. Richardson for three. He's off on that one. Lakers are gone. Two or three here to start out the game. Drives from the block. Here's Odom. A three-pointer is right on target. The assist going to Bryant. Cody's been improving on that facet of his game. Phoenix is gone. One of three from beyond the arc so far in the game. Now, here's Nash. If you're just tuning in, we played about two and a half minutes here in the first. There's the pass to front. Will it go? An absolute palm from three-point range. You know, Nash is an excellent distributor, a phenomenal floor general, great at recognizing when his guys are open. Richardson against Bryant. To the inside, Gasol. And Gasol with the dunk. Yeah, just a simple one-hand flush. I think he got a few more inches on his vertical by going with the spike. Yeah, I agree with you. That's what it looked like to me. I mean, he was way up there. Here's Nash. First quarter of play, we're about three minutes in. Pass to Richardson. Dudley with a screen on Bryant. Richardson against Kobe. Five on the clock. Here's Nash. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. Coming into this, having notched a win against the Rockets in their last game. And, and guys, they, they walked into the arena with a certain kind of swagger. And we really saw it play out on the offensive end. And you know, confidence is key there. Um, they seem to play with a ton of it, especially on the offensive end. First quarter of play and uh, just over three and a half minutes in. They set the pick. Nash kicks the front. 
And it's off from three-point range. Lakers leading by five. From deep, Fisher. Second shot opportunity. And it's laid in by Odom. Odom's got five now. Every time they get scored on during this run, it's come from inside the paint. Nash against Fisher. Pass to Fry. Launches it from deep. The long distance three is buried. Fry's got his second bucket of the night. How much fun would it be to play with Steve Nash? I mean, man, I know everybody who can score it or shoot it would love to be on the floor with him. And here is Los Angeles now. Phoenix able to drain the three. Outside, Kobe. Down it goes, his third basket. He's now three for four. And I love the tenacity, guys. He simply can will his way into games at times and exert his presence. Suns trail by six. Richardson outside. Down to five on the shot clock. The tray. That one misses. Not quite enough defense that time around. Just lucky he was off. The NBA season has only just begun. Clark, how badly do these teams want to get things off to a great start? Kevin, nothing feels better than getting off to a really good start. Able to establish yourselves early. That's the desire of every team. To let folks know we're going to be here and we're good for the long run. The free throw drops for Kobe. So much to like about Bryant's game, but the X factor in my mind is his unmatched competitiveness and work rate. This guy has an inexhaustible appetite for work. Goran Dragic has checked in for Phoenix. And at the line, it's all about consistency with him. His routine, his stroke, it never wavers. Pass to front. No good that time. Good D by Gasol. Here's Bryant. Here's Odom. That's in coming off an assist from Bryant. Kobe's got three assists in the game. They should continue to get the ball inside. The defense struggling to contain them. And when you make five in a row in close like that, it also takes pressure off your perimeter guys, too. Now here's Dragic. Coming in off a 21-point game, his last outing. The kick out to Hill, and it goes out of bounds. That went off Dragic. And a moment now to look at the stats for Dragic. How he did last season. Last season, he averaged eight points a game. Three assists and two rebounds. And there isn't much to write home about with his numbers. I think he'd like to up his contributions. Yeah, but you got to earn that chance. I mean, you get what you earn. His numbers are fine, but he's not going to get a lot more floor time unless he turns it up a notch. Catching up on the changes for Phoenix. Akeem Warwick, he's checked in for Dudley. And it's Childress in for Jason Richardson. One fifty-seven left to play in the first. Dragic dishes to Fry. Back to Dragic. And the foul called on G. That is his first foul of the game. First team foul. There's a minute 47 left to play in the first quarter. Rogic kicks to Fry. Just five on the clock. Some nice ball movement here by the Suns. Here's Hill. And they've done a nice job controlling the defensive backboard to start this game. Not one second chance bucket allowed. That is finishing off good defense. Here's G at the elbow. It's Fisher. Three-pointer. It's holding by Fry. It's stolen by G. The pass to Bryant. Here's Odom. Back to Kobe. Offside Gasol. He dishes it to Fisher. Back to Gasol. 
Wants to get it to Odom and does. Here's Kobe. That balls. Nice feed that time from Odom. Kobe's got 12. Defensively, giving up far too many time open out, out. rhythm looks. And to battle back, Guard. they've got to shore up the defense. I mean, there's no other way to come back from a deficit unless you play good defense. And first time out of the game called for Phoenix. Changes for Phoenix. Robin Lopez is checked in for Fry. Turkoglu comes in for Hill. And Nash is subbed in for Goran Dragic. Here's Warwick. Scoreless thus far. They could use a bucket. That's good on the jump shot. This is Nash's bread and butter, his decision making in the pick and roll. Masterful. Ryan passes to Gasol. Lopez with the steal. Now eight seconds separate in the two clocks. Nash outside. Lopez, a screen on Fisher. And here's Turkoglu from the arc. Rebound the Lakers. Here's G. Playing Houston, he was nearly unstoppable. And he banks in the layup. G's got his second basket. Displaying intensity right off the opening tip, especially on the offensive end. Tell you what, forget about easing into the game. They came out with punt blazing. And so it's the Los Angeles Lakers sitting with a comfortable lead up by 14. Their defense has been terrific in this game. We'll get right back to the action when we return. So far through one quarter, it's been a lopsided game. We'll see if that changes here in the second. And what's your take, guys, on the hustle sticks for the Lakers? Look at the fast break point total from these guys. I mean, they're really hustling, working hard. And those hustle points are showing up on the scoreboard. And, guys, they've also done a great job generating offense from their defense, forcing turnovers and making the defense pay for those mistakes. Fisher against Nash. Passes it to Childress. Four on the clock. Makes it off the glass. How about how he sets his man up there, runs him right into the screen, and then gets the basket. Here's G, and G with the stuff. Kevin, he is tough to stop when he gets to the rim. Yeah, Greg, he can get up a few notches higher. Well, and that's exactly how the game is played in the paint inside, guys. I mean, if you can play over the top, I think you've got a big advantage. Nash against Fisher. From downtown, Steve Nash, and that's good. Nash has got eight points. You know, the stroke of Nash, so pure. He's got a nice, high, archy shot. A deadly three-point shooter, too. And that one's good from Fisher. The real come at us, and we're coming right back at you. A little back and forth from long range. I love it. That's a terrific answer there. Pass to Childress. And we're now about a minute and a half into the second quarter. His second shot goes in. Off to a good start, two for two. A, a tough start scoring the basketball, but they're starting to turn it around now. Yeah, it looks like they've gained a little bit of confidence as the lid has come off the hoop. G kicks it to Oda. G dishes to Gasol. Good D 
screen by Lopez. Boy, patrolling the paint well, protecting the rim, that's exactly the kind of defensive effort you need against him. Lopez, a screen on Fisher. Nash. That's in, and that's his fourth basket of the night. He's taken seven shots, a solid 57%. Boy, he's really been dominant in this one. Unfortunately, he hasn't had much help. And here's Fisher outside. Here's Gasol, and finish off by Gasol. And really, Gasol just never stops attacking the boards, just utterly relentless at pounding the glass. In the corner, it's Circaloo. Launches a three. Good, and the assist goes to Nash. Nash has got three assists tonight. And doing a much better job from three-point range than they were in the first. It's going to help them chip away at that lead. And the basket by Kobe. Slicing them up. Kobe so slick on the drive. Now, here's Childress. About three minutes played so far in the second quarter. Knocked away. It's stolen by G. On the wing, Fisher. There's the triple. The shot is good. It's his second bucket in five tries. And, and I like the fact that he really was unfazed by that scoreless first quarter. And now you can see him getting into a rhythm. Turkaloo right side. The kick out to Lopez. Lock at six. And it's a defensive three-second violation. The Suns shooting their first free throw of the night here. And the technical free throw is good. And the NBA hosting games overseas as far back, Clark, is as 1978. Always exhibition contest, but do you think we will see a regular season game played abroad? That's what I'm hearing, and it could be as soon as next season, Kevin. The game is global, and we know the league is desiring to get games played elsewhere outside of the United States. It certainly adds to the excitement and drama of the league, so I think it happens. The kick out to Odom for the three. And again, it's the Lakers from deep. And I love how Odom stretches the floor. They're always ready to shoot from distance when the defense isn't focused. Suns trail by 16. Nash outside. There's the drive. Rebounded by Odom. Odom's got four rebounds in this game. G passes to Gasol. Here's G. Richardson cover. Out of bounds. Phoenix takes possession. Phoenix ball. Let's give a look now at the 2K leaderboard to see who led the league in assists last year. Number one, Steve Nash. And it was the kind of season that he tried to repeat over and, and over. Nobody was better at creating easy baskets for their teammates. Grant Hill. He's checked in for Childress. Phoenix has gotten it going from downtown in the second quarter. They're three of three on three pointers. Richardson against Kobe. They set the screen. Just five to shoot. Nash kicks to Richardson. From deep. G with the rebound. G's got five rebounds tonight. And here's Kobe from the arc. Here's Gasol. Yep, that one goes. Gasol's got four this quarter. And the stick with it attitude of Gasol just overwhelming the defense with his length. On the wing, Jason Richardson, guarded by Kobe. Nash left side, wide open. G with the rebound. The defense there got away with a major lapse. Got a piece of it. It's stolen by Hill. Nash outside. Nash to Hill. And here is Dudley. Some nice ball movement here by the Suns. High inside. Working on Gasol. No good from Fry. So for Phoenix, their last game, a win against the Jazz in Salt Lake City. Here's Gasol. 
And Fisher kicks to G. Here's Bryant. Goes straight through the defender for the dunk. Draws the foul. He'll go to the line. That's called on Channing Fry. And when you foul Bryant, you really got to foul him, or else he's going to make it an end one. The Lakers have gone two for two in the game at the line. Goran Dragic has checked in for Nash. Suns trail by 21. They've been looking out of sync offensively. Yeah, the, the, their offense has ground started to a standstill. Phoenix calls timeout. And they also showed up defensively. Top five in terms of opponent field goal percentage. They really won a lot of games on that side of the floor. And you just mentioned it. What a year it was for them on the glass. The sheer effort and energy they put into their rebounding was tremendous. Hill kicks to Dragic. Dishes it to Richardson. And there's the pass to Fry. Back to Richardson. There's the screen. Shot clock at six. Takes it inside. Misses and the dry spell continues. And a big lead for them on both the scoreboard and the backboard thus far. Yeah, rebounding has been a big key in this one. They've asserted their will and have taken control on the glass. Fisher against Dragic. Kicks it out to Richardson. And again, it's the Suns missing. Not sure why he keeps trying his luck from deep here. It's just not his night. And that one's good by G. Coming off a big game, his confidence couldn't be higher. And Coach knows it. Showing no signs of slowing or cooling down. They're going to ride him as far as he can take him. Passes to Dudley. To the paint. Wants to get it to Hill and does. Tries again. And it's denied. They retain possession. Fry finds Hill. This is definitely a day he'd like to forget. He just hasn't had the energy or the intensity to get it done out there. He's still scoreless. I mean, even from over here, you can see that one pretty clearly. No question about it. I mean, a ton of contact and a good call by the officials. It's his first trip to the line. The free throw drops for Fisher. Hey, you can't judge a book by its cover, nor can you judge Derek Fisher by his size. He's a lot stronger than he looks and has deceptive athleticism for his build. The Suns making a switch here. Nash has checked in. Richardson against Bryant. Pass to Nash. Richardson outside. Pass to Dudley. Grant Hill on the way. His last outing, 16 points for him. No doubt the quarter just not going his way. Still scoreless. And the dunk by Odom. Oh, getting to the rim with ease. Lamar Odom, the lefty with the finish. Phoenix has gone 6 of 14 with the three ball tonight. Just a little over 40%. Nash with no one around. Phoenix no good that time either. No matter what looks they get, they just can't convert to stop this run. And, you know, they've got to be careful because this is when the team concept breaks down and guys start playing hero ball. And so it's Los Angeles rolling along with a 27-point lead as we wrap up the quarter. The scoring has been tremendous, and they are shooting lights out with very high accuracy. And we've got more in 2K Sports coming your way after this break.
And after a very lopsided first half, we'll see if things play out a little more evenly here in the second. You look at Kobe Bryant in this game, he's been everywhere. And the way that he has helped out with the ball movement has been a difference maker early on. And you know, that's not a job they ask him to do very often, but in the first half, I thought he was in perfect sync with his teammates. And there wasn't too much drama in the first half, but maybe things will tighten up here in the second. Los Angeles has gone 5 of 10 from downtown tonight. 50% exactly. Cranes the three-pointer. 14 points for G. And with the lead, I like the strategy here. Continue to get the ball to guys who can do something with it. If it's working, keep working it. That's what I say. Keep the pressure on them. Hill left side. Back to Richardson. Shot clock at five. And it's off the back rim. No good. And Los Angeles guys uh, shooting the lights out in this one. 77%. Here's Kobe. And a lot of contact on that one. So he'll shoot two here. That's called on Channing Fry. Much respect for Kobe. Defense got over anxious there. He's made all three of his free throws so far. And converted more than four out of every five free throw attempts last year. So just solid at the line. You know, he really did excel at the stripe. I mean, they couldn't have asked for too much more from him when it came to knocking down free throws. Phoenix has gotten the three-point bug tonight. They've taken 15 shots outside the arc. Six of 15. Richardson the pass to Hill. Nash against Kobe. It's back to Hill. Good, and the assist goes to Nash. Hill's got his first two points. Tell you what, good luck trying to stop Hill inside. I mean, once he's this deep, the defense is done. It's tipped. A pass to Gasol. To the left wing. Here's G. It's three-pointers off the mark. Definitely a situation you want to make sure you don't give him too good of a look. And here's Dudley for three. Hits the three-point bomb. And I don't care how far from the bucket he is. You've got to have a man on him. He's just too good from deep. Odom finds Gasol. The kick out to Odom. Wants to get it to Kobe and does. Lakers passing it around. Here's G. It's good again in an excellent 7 for 8 shooting night so far. And that bucket adds to what has been a big difference in points in the paint between the two teams. Yeah, it's really been quite a contrast. I like the way they're attacking the middle um, at their offensive end. Here's Nash. Softly drops in the floater. Nash has got 13. They found a nice groove in this half, starting out three for four. And so Fisher will bring it up for L.A. Following this one, they get to host the Warriors. That game marks the first half of a quick two-game homestand. When he catches the hot hand, good luck trying to slow him down. Plays so under control, can spot up, drive, create for himself. A matchup nightmare. Nash against Fisher. Nash outside. And he gets the whistle for the three-second three call. And how about first in terms of three-point shooting, the damage they do from beyond, maybe the biggest offensive weapon in our league. And having the best offense in the league last season, they were an opponent that no team wanted to face. Kobe, the pass to Gasol. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. Hey, Gasol's game is smooth, but he's got a tough edge to him as well. The Lakers have gone a perfect 7 of 7 from the line tonight. Taking two shots. And the first one drops. And he makes both free throws. You know, you watch Pau Gasol, and he's got unbelievable length and really outstanding skill and the desire to be great. Hill sets the screen for Richardson. It's Hill on the wing. 
Richardson outside. Just four to shoot. They set the pick over Gasol. And it hung on the rim, but wouldn't fall for him. Yet that's another miss for him. They're behind in this game largely because he shot so poorly. It's good. Guys, his consistency in terms of shooting has really helped them seize control. The Suns have gone three of five to start the second half, developing a nice rhythm out there. Outside Hill. Shot to stop the run. Good, and the assist goes to Nash. Nash has got his seventh assist of the game with that last one. A little under two and a half minutes off the clock now here in the third. Blocking foul called Jared Dudley. Second personal foul. Third team foul. Shot from the inbound, and Bryant puts it in. And that's now 24 points for Kobe Bryant. And how about Odom facilitating the shooter there, not holding the ball or forcing his own shot? The Suns have gone 4 or 6 from the field since the start of the third. There's the pick. Nash, the pass to Hill. Now Dudley. Five to shoot. The Suns need to get a shot off. Richardson for three. The shot will not fall. Some solid defense from Kobe. Takes a three. And another three for the Lakers. The assist totals, Kevin, just continue to grow. They're way ahead in that category. Ball movement has been flawless. Clearly just an example of a different mindset between these teams. Richardson up top. Defended by Bryant. And it's blocked. Boy, this is um, bad. Tough to watch. I mean, this is really bad. He's stone cold this quarter. Man. Out of bounds. Phoenix takes possession. Let's take a look at the players who were the best on the glass a season ago. Fourth, Pau Gasol. What a season he had in the paint. I mean, his rebounding numbers, really mind-boggling. Who wouldn't love to have a guy like that? Goran Dragic is checked in for the Suns. Phoenix has gone one of two from beyond the arc since coming out of the break. Richardson attacking. Good on the seven footer. Richardson's got his second basket of the night. On the drive that time, Richardson gets to full speed in a hurry. Down low, here's Odom, and the dunk by Odom. And, and slams it home and gets some camera time on the end of it. He did. He, he spent a while up in that rim, didn't he? The refs are much more lenient with that kind of situation than they used to be. Fisher against Dragic. He kicks to Dublin. On the wing, Jason Richardson, guarded by Kobe. Here's Richardson. Some solid defense from Bryant. The shooting numbers just aren't there yet in the quarter. He feeds it to Fisher. And the layup is good. Fisher. Fisher's got 10 points. You know, because of his size, he can be at a disadvantage inside, but Fisher knows how to work around that. For Phoenix, they've gone even 5 of 10 on shot attempts in the third. Richardson against Bryant. Passes it to Dragic. Here is Dudley. Nice ball movement by Phoenix. Outside Dragic. Beyond the arc. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. Geez. Here's Fisher. It's good. 12 points for him. Oh, perfect execution and transition. Fisher getting to the right spot and being rewarded for it. 156 left in the third quarter. Guys are looking for a spark here. Yeah, a cold stretch offensively, for sure. Outside Dragic. Over Fisher. Dragic gets the bucket. 136 left in the third. Kobe passes to Gasol. Second chance effort. And it's Phoenix with the rebound. 
and not allowing the shooter even an inch of breathing room on that one. And guys, that's exactly the kind of high impact defense they want to see out of him. And Dudley kicks to Fry. Off target with his three. And they had some botched coverage that turned into no coverage. Here's Gasol. And it's Phoenix with the rebound. Fry has got his seventh rebound here tonight. With some arc. And Dragic with the lay-in. And not being as aggressive from the three-point line anymore. They had a lot more attempts in that first half. Outside, Odom. Here's G. He's guarded by Hill. From deep, Fisher. They get the rebound. Another shot. And the layup is up and in. Gasol. Gasol's got 12. Inside, Gasol is deadly. I mean, his height means finding a shot this close. Not too much work at all for him. And Fry kicks to Richardson. There's a screen. Knocks it loose. Bryant looking over the floor. Gasol. And Gasol slams it in. Exactly what you want to see from Powell Gasol. I mean, being aggressive and attacking the rim. Now Drogic. Puts up a deep three. And the last second attempt doesn't fall. And so it's Kobe Bryant making things happen for Los Angeles. A terrific quarter for him. And now he has a total of 27 points. Shouldn't take him long to get up over 30. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back. And there have been two very different performances from these teams today as we get going in quarter number four. The Sun shooting at 36% on the night. They've got to step it up offensively. Feeds to Lopez. On the dunk by Lopez. At seven feet tall, dunking is very easy for Lopez. Once he's this deep, the defense is in trouble. Pass to Gasol. That's good. And it's Kobe with the assist. Kobe's got assist number eight now on the night. And here's Nash. Pass to Childress. Nash against Fisher. Nash the pass to Lopez. And here's what the schedule looks like for the Los Angeles Lakers. On Sunday, the Golden State Warriors come into town, tipping off a homestand for them. And then on Tuesday, they'll defend home court against the Memphis Grizzlies. That free throw good from Lopez. And the fun-loving personality Lopez has makes him a likable teammate. It's clear that they love playing with him. Lopez hits them both. So it's the Lakers now. Lopez with the steal. Fisher against Nash. The kick out to Lopez. Now here's Childress. He's tightly guarded. Six to shoot. The rebound by Gasol. Gasol's got double-digit rebounds now in the game. And then G with the jam. Coaches yeah, want the ball Fisher. in his hands because Fisher makes good decisions. He's got a really good basketball mind. And it's the Suns with the ball. 
And the pass to Warwick. Back to Nash. Kicks it out to Turkaloo. Good, and the assist goes to Nash. Nash has got his ninth assist in the game now. And not a shot you see often from Turkaloo showing off his skills there. And Bryant throws it down. Derek oh, get out of his way. No way the D was going to slow him down. Not that time. He was determined to get those points. Nash outside. They set the pick. Rebounded by Odom. Odom's got six rebounds here tonight. Kobe with it. Guarded now by Nash. And Kobe gets it to go. Fantastic ball movement. They're picking them apart with their passing. Purposeful passing it is, partner. Their last 10 points have all come off assist. The Suns have gone two of four from the field since we started the final quarter of play. Fourth quarter of play, and we're about two and a half minutes through it right now. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on Lamar Odom. That is his first foul of the game. And Phoenix making a change here. Fry's checked in. For your sons, number eight, Channing Fry. Now, here's Childress, guarded by Kobe. Childress, the pass to Warwick. The rebound by Kobe Bryant. Enzo Bryant will bring it up for a oh, mm. I tell you what, he's showing some real courage going to the reverse in that situation. You know, I, I don't think he knows you're not supposed to do that in traffic. <laughs> well, I tell you what, don't tell him. I mean, I want to see it again. Warwick dishes to Nash. It's stolen by Odom. And it's the Lakers on the break. And it's G finishing it off. And this offense is in a perfect rhythm. And you can see how they're finishing their plays. Boy, this is borderline ridiculous. I mean, every single attempt finding the bottom of the bucket. Passes it to Warwick. Nash against Fisher. To halt the run. And here's Turkaloo for three. Good, and the assist goes to Nash. Nash has got assist number 10 tonight with that last one. A bit under three and a half minutes have passed here in the fourth. And G with the stuff. A one-man show offensively, and that's almost always good news for his team. The Suns have gone three of six from the field so far in the fourth quarter. Turkaloo kicks to Fry. Nice ball movement by Phoenix. Here's Nash. The teardrop falls in. And Nash is such a clever player. A sensational floater from such an unpredictable player. On the wing, Bryant. Defended by Childress. Yes, that goes in. Bryant. Bryant's got six in the quarter. Man, have they been effective at getting the ball inside. I tell you, we're taking a look at some real deficiencies defensively. I mean, they've given up five straight good looks in the paint. Pass to Nash, over Fisher. Nash's shot is off. Uh, you can't look at the result of that shot. They'll take that whenever they get it. Well, you know, I hear you. That's a good look, but when you're that wide open, I think you got to knock it down. Yeah, he just flat out tricked that one, missed it, and has no one to blame but himself. That's a textbook example of how to move the ball. Boy, you got to love that action. For Los Angeles, they've gone on a tear here in the fourth. They're eight of nine on field goal attempts in the quarter. Wasted no time on that one. And now it's 27 points for G. He's just stretching them out. The defense has got to do a better job of staying attached to him. Yeah, especially with the score being what it is. I mean, you got to tighten it up on D. There's a good screen. Nash kicks to Fry. Tried to answer back, but that three is off the mark. And it's the Lakers ball. And Gasol slams it in. Nice piece of hustle from Gasol. Got back quickly in transition to score. Phoenix has gone two or three in the fourth quarter from long range. Good shooting so far. Nash to Fry. 
Now, here's Childress. Fouled in the act of shooting. Gets the bucket anyway, so a three-point play chance for him. This second half has really been all about paint scores. They've done a good job with that, getting that ball inside. Jared Dudley's checked in for the Suns. Hill comes in for Hito Turkoglu. And so it's the Lakers with it. Bryant finds Odom, and he gets the bucket. And defensively, they are on their heels every time the ball comes inside. Yeah, I think they've got to ramp up the aggressiveness. If they don't, things are just going to get worse from here. Nash, the pass to Childress. Inside, here's Hill. Basket is good. He'll get a chance for one more at the line. Hill able to stretch the floor, making it tough on defenses to guard him. Jason Richardson, he's checked in for Childress. And a moment to look at the scoring approach in terms of where the points are coming from for Los Angeles. They're still slashing and attacking the rim, and the defense yet to make the adjustment and keep the ball in front. And they've also been ferocious inside, really taking advantage in the painted area and making good on those chances. The Suns have gotten more than 58% of their attempts to go down for them in the fourth quarter. They're 7 of 12. Richardson gets a wide-open look from outside off the mark. And I thought that was going to drop. It looked good from here. And they double up Bryant. And Fisher gets it to go on the assist by Bryant. And I've been impressed with the unselfishness, but also getting guys the ball where they can do something with it. He is delivering a lot of room service times tonight. One sweet one after another. Nash kicks to Dudley. The pass to Hill. Down to five on the shot clock. And they'll keep possession. And so it looks like the Suns will retain possession here. Let's take a second look at that fantastic block. And guys, that is lockdown defense at its finest. Going right at the shot and then able to knock it away. Shot clock at two from deep three-point territory. And right from the get-go, they stood out as the better team. Their hunger to dominate and play for each other was outstanding for the Lakers. And this was one that never really was in doubt, I thought, an all-around dominant performance. And you kind of thought that maybe even going into the game. Yeah, there was a sense of that in men. They, they just pretty much blew them right out of the water. A clinic was put on display here today. And so with this, they'll end up with their second win on the year. Hey, you always hope to take charge of the season series by winning that first game. This will put them up one nothing. Three games left still to play this year against the Suns. And you know, looking back at all the contributions tonight, it was a really phenomenal all-around game for G. He was really important under the basket, making the plays down low and getting position to pull in rebound. Master Dudley. Now here's Richardson. Dudley with a screen on Bryant. Richardson the pass to Dudley. Hill has the open look. There it is. It's Nash picking up the assists. You can appreciate the fight now, but it isn't how they came into the game. Yeah, you know, I agree with you. They waited too long to finally ramp themselves up. And Bryant kicks to Gasol. Pulls up on the wing. It's hauled in by Fry. Richardson against Bryant. Nash with it. And so it's the Lakers taking care of business here. This crowd was stunned by the manner in which their team was dismantled. You know what? Shocking. I don't care what the matchup is. You never expect a road team to come in and just cruise to the kind of win they did tonight. And that's going to do it tonight, folks, for our broadcast. For Clark Kellogg, Greg Anthony, and David Ohm, this is Kevin Harlan thanking you for watching the NBA presented by 2K Sports. So long.